1970 saw a body design updated with flared fenders to reduce wheel thrown debris damage a problem in the 68 and 69 models. New fender louvers replaced the four vertical slots of the 68-69 model. Exhaust tips were rectangular replacing the round style of early years and front grills were square mesh. Parking lamps located at the grill's outer edge had clear lenses with amber bulbs. This is a beautiful 1970 convertible. Emblems are in great shape. Our chrome is in very good shape. And our paint is in very good shape. Wearing the American Mag wheels. This is a non-original 350 cubic inch engine. As you can see with a few add-ons. It does have the hooker side pipes. So you do have to be careful getting in and out of this particular car. Has the Edelbrock Performance RPM aluminum heads. As I said, the hooker headers and side pipes. It also has a Kenwood CD player. Bright blue interior, four speed. Gauges in very good shape, as well as your seating areas. Just a real nice example of a beautiful 1970, ready for your local show, your favorite road. Car is in very good shape with a very nice frame, and it's definitely worth a look. Our convertible top is in good shape as well, free of any major issues, scratches, rips, tears, or anything of the sort. Our back window is nice and clear. And our rear chrome bumpers are in excellent shape as well. The number is 770-605-2056. If I can assist you with this or any of the hundreds of Corvettes we carry in stock. Or email me, john at buyabet.net, if I can assist you. As always, subscribe to the YouTube channel so you can see all this fun new inventory first. And we'll see you all out on the road. Thank you.